Hi, this is Karen McNall, and I'm an independent demonstrator with Stampin' Up! And today I'm going to show you how you can make a quick and simple card with just a stamp set and one ink color. Let's get started. Today's sample shows a card with Tangerine Tango as a card base. But today I'm going to show you another way you can change it up with just one simple color. So today's card base brings in early espresso, and that is cut five and a half by eight and a half and scored at four and a quarter. Our next panel is a piece of Tangerine Tango and it is cut two and a half by five and three eighths. Our next panel is from the uh, Painted Autumn Designer Series paper and it is cut two and a quarter by five and one eighth. And we're going to just run our adhesive on the back side of this, this piece of Designer Series paper and we'll adhere it to the Tangerine Tango panel. And we're looking for a quarter of an inch border on all four sides. Our next step is to take a half of a piece of doily, and this is a, the um, delicate doilies, and I've just cut it in half, and we're just gonna add a little bit of adhesive to the middle. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that panel that we just created and we're just going to put it on the top on the top of the doily and I'm looking at the spaces here and making sure it's straight and using my grid paper from Stampin' Up. And I'll just turn it over and I'm going to add more adhesive to the back side. And when you're running your adhesive over the doily, you've got to be very careful not to rip it because it's very thin. I'm just going to add a little bit here and a little bit there. Now we'll bring in our card base and we're going to adhere it, this panel, to the card, front of the card base and we're looking at an eighth of an inch border, very small border, on all three sides. And we'll just adhere this down. Okay, our next step is to, um, I've done this ahead of time and I've used the stitched framelits and Tangerine Tango and, and Very Vanilla. So we're going to bring in our Stamp and Pierce mat with this piece of scrap paper and we're going to use our Early Espresso ink and we're going to ink up the sentiment and stamp on the, the circle. So just ink that up carefully and we're just looking top, bottom, left and right and there we have it. So then we're done with our ink for today. We'll close that up. And now we're gonna just take our adhesive and we're gonna add it to the back side of the circle. And then we're gonna adhere it to the Tangerine Tango stitch circle. Our next step is just to add more adhesive to the back side of this one. And then we'll bring in our card. And I'm gonna place it right on the, I'm going to cover up this solid part of the doily and I'm just going to look at it making sure it all, it's all straight and I'm going to adhere it to the front. Now our next step is to bring in for the inside I've got a very vanilla piece and that is cut four by five and a quarter and I also have a piece a very small strip of the designer series paper and that is cut one half inch by four and we're just going to take our adhesive and we're just going to add it to the back side of the strip and add it to the bottom of the card. And I like to leave a little bit of space at the bottom so it's not completely flush. Alright, so then I'm going to flip this over, add some adhesive to the top, and we're going to add it to the inside of the card. So this leaves you a, a pretty large area to write your message. Our next step is to add the bling to the card. So today I am using the metallic enamel shapes and I'll show you up close. They come in silver and gold. And we have stars, hearts, and circles. And the circles come in five different sizes. So today I'll use the, um, we'll use silver today and I'll use the, let's go with a star. So I'm just going to use my paper piercer to take it off of the plastic sheet. And I'm going to bring in my card. I'm going to add it right to this area here that doesn't have any ink. I'm just going to press down gently. 
Now the final step is to add a little bit more bling using our Wink Estella. So I'm just going to take my Wink Estella and I'm just going to cover color over all the pumpkins. And that just adds a little bit of shimmer to your pumpkins and just brightens up the designer series paper even more than what it is. So we're just going to color these over. I'm not sure if you can see it on camera, but I'll try to, once I'm done, I'll bring it up close. So you can decide which color combination you like best. Do you like the early espresso card base or do you like the tangerine tango? You decide. And here's, I'm not sure if you can see it, but um, it is there. Okay, so our two cards today, Tangerine Tango, and let's let's put, actually put it against the white. Tangerine Tango or Early Espresso. You decide. Please leave a comment below and let me know what you think. For all your Stampin' Up! needs, please visit my website at inspiredbygram.com. Thank you.